At Yashe, we work at promoting climate smart agricultural practices. One of those practices is the Ingali cropping system. Uh, this is a system that we actually started promoting in the Maya Golden Landscape uh, in 2016. Uh, the objective really is to uh, help restore uh, degraded lands so that farmers can increase uh, their yields in the various crops that they cultivate within the system. Uh, in essence, it is the growing of uh, Inga edulis uh, trees in rows that are about 15 to 18 feet apart. These uh, trees uh, develop and then form a canopy which shades out weeds that generally negatively impact the crops of our farmers. After two and a half years these trees are coppiced and the leaves are added to the area between the two rows and um, the crops are then planted in that thick mulch which has been suppressing weeds over the years because Inga produces a lot of biomass. This biomass accumulates on the soil surface and it creates the um, ideal conditions for nutrient recycling and the development of the soil microorganisms. Recently we had a training uh, for farmers from the Green Creek Farmers Cooperative. Um, we had a boat men, women and youths involved in this training where they were learning about the uh, nursery establishment and seed selection of the Inga plant and how it can be used uh, on their uh, farmlands. Um, we also had the participation of two of our uh, lead Inga farmers in the Maya Golden landscape, Mr. Orlando Kukul and Mr. Bartolo Teul, both who have had a lot of experience with Ingali cropping uh, in the Maya Golden landscape. We also were, we also want to express our gratitude to Mr. William Chun, who also has an Inga demonstration plot uh, for uh, providing his uh, plot as a, a demonstration area for this training.